China has confirmed that its very first space station is coming to a fiery end. In a news conference last week, officials appeared to admit they lost control of the space station and they expect it to fall back to Earth and burn up in late 2017. So I guess the question is, how does an agency lose control of their space station? You know, actually, it's very tricky to uh, manage the, uh, the operation of spacecraft in space because there's so many different factors that, ex that affect the motion of the spacecraft. So we have to consider that gravity is always pulling on the spacecraft, and so that spacecraft always needs a fuel supply to keep it boosted up above the Earth's gravitational pull, or far enough up that the Earth's atmosphere also doesn't interfere with its motion. So the Earth's atmosphere drags on the spacecraft, Actual gravity itself is also pulling it down, so it also always has to be reboosted up in order to avoid that. And you may not realize this, but International Space Station does the same thing. Every few months or so, it has a boost to bring it back up to its operating altitude, and over that period of time, it, that, that, that altitude decays. So in this case, they probably ran out of fuel, they don't have enough to boost it back up, and so inevitably, you know, what goes up is going to come down. <laughs> and what's going to happen when it does come down? Is there any danger? There's always danger. And the thing that we have to be concerned about is that the heaviest parts of this spacecraft may not completely burn up on reentry. And so that means that they could come down and strike the surface someplace. Hopefully, they've been able to at least steer or control it enough that they can manage to have it descend over open ocean. Mm. That's, not, that's not unusual. That's happened before, where large pieces of incoming spacecraft burning up don't completely incinerate, and those heavier pieces fall into oceans. So you know what I have to do, Derek and Christine? I have to check my Zodiac to make sure that I am not anywhere near those chunks of falling spacecraft. That's going to be the and key. And buy a titanium umbrella. <laughs> <laughs> get that at... Where do uh, I get one of those? What's, what, are those what are those stores um, that they sell? All that, Amazon? Like, no, not Amazon. <laughs> just, just send me a note. I have them. I'll be happy to sell you one. All right. <laughs> we'll send you a COD. <laughs> Thank you, Derek. <laughs> my pleasure. Thank you.